first. Although, doesn't it end at noon? Isn't that the rule? I got 20 minutes. So you got 20 minutes to do this trick. Yeah, yeah. But no, it, it has nothing to do with April Fool's. What okay. it has to do with is the weather. Because, right. you know, you know, in London, we have two seasons. Winter and construction. And construction, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, and, and they were talking about this. Actually, Jay, Jay uh, uh, San, Sanford, the, the, the guy who does the, the environmental stuff. Yes. Yeah, you've interviewed him, but I just can't remember yes, his last name. You know, Stanford. Guy. Stanford. Stanford with a T. Yes. Uh, he's the pothole guy. He is the pothole he's guy. He's the pothole guy. That's what it says on his business cards. Yes, it does. And and uh, I I had a run in with him. You did. Yes, I did. You had a run in with the I pothole guy. I want to tell you the story, okay. but I I have a visual aid. That is a diagram of your street. That's I'm my a diagram of my my neighborhood. Yes. Okay. Yeah, I'll wait till we. Yep, there you there, go. Oh, there we go. Uh, now it, well, you'll notice here. Actually, the uh, uh, I, I'm right here. I'm right here with the X. So that's your house there. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I live right around the corner from my good friend Steve. He was here last last month. Yeah. Yeah, Steve. That you, that you can tell that's his house. He has that's an S on his roof. That's interesting. Yes. That's so that you can. Uh, well, the he rescue helicopters can find him. That's good planning. Yeah. Now um, I'll tell you the story about the pothole in a minute. Okay. But before we get to that point, I would love to draw a little map of where you live. Do you mind? I don't mind at all. Okay, that's perfect. Oh, we have a little bit. Mine's timing. pretty easy. Now, are you on a straight street or? I I'm on a Cold? straight street. Like straight, straight and narrow as, as the Baptist church. Right until it turns. Stops. <laughs> it it okay. does turn. But right, that's fair. That's fair. Because I, I want to try and make this as accurate as we can for the folks at home here. Right. Um, now, are you, uh, would you be in the middle of the street? Are you, well, I'll put you in the middle of the street anyway. No, um, I'm on the side. If I was in the middle, I'd be hit by cars. That's true. Constantly. I don't, well, it'd <laughs> probably easier if I did this down here. Okay. Now, I didn't bother with, because you live on a straight street, you said, and I'm yes. not going to bother to actually do the cross street here, which is okay. Um, so, for sake of argument here, I'm going to put you uh, right in the center. That's actually pretty perfect. Yeah. Okay, that, that's good. 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 That's now, pretty accurate and, representation uh, of my house. E is your last name. E for Eastwood. Good, good. There and I'm is. assuming there's other houses on the street? There are, okay, actually. Okay, a few there. Good, yep. good, good, good. Excellent. Um, I realize this is not to scale, so don't go there. No, because my um, house is much smaller than everybody yeah, well, else. Well, I tried to not get on your good books by giving you the, the biggest house on the, on the block there, is it? Well, thank you. Yeah, I appreciate that. Welcome. But you're, yeah, you're right. That is not accurate. Anyway, I want to tell you the story about the pothole while we have a little bit of time here. And it's, okay. it's kind of a neat story. Okay. But in order to make this a little bit more uh, visual for television, I have my pothole maker. I, I like this. You do. You're actually going to create a pothole in the street. I'm, I'm going to try. Now, I don't suggest you do this at home. Why not? Well, I'm a trained professional. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I am. I, uh, and, and besides, the first time I tried this, <laughs> I darn near punched myself out. I'm sure you, you did. <laughs> yeah, I did. Anyway, I want you to notice, guys, that that is an absolutely deep pothole. That is. As a matter of fact. Like uh, infinite. Yeah, as a matter of fact, it goes all the way through to the uh, to Australia. Can you see the little guy waving at you? Hi. Good day. <laughs> yeah. Good day, mate. Yeah. Now, uh, when I woke up and found this, I did phone Jay, and he said, I said, can you come down and fix it? And? And he said, no. Oh. So I did it myself. What I did was I grabbed the pothole can and I dragged it down the street. What? Yeah. Uh, I turned the corner and I left it right in front of my good friend, <laughs> believe it or not, Steve's house. And that is the same pothole. Yeah, you see right there? You see the little guy waving at you? What? Good day. Yeah, it's really cool. He got annoyed. He phoned me and said, Pete, did you do that again? I said, yeah. So he said, would you fix it? So I grabbed the pothole again and I dragged it down the street. I dragged it past my house this time. Yeah, and you know what? I left the neighborhood. You know, I live in the Northeast End. Uh, that, right? Yeah, and, and I drove all the way to Oak Ridge. Because I have a friend of mine who lives in Oak Ridge, yeah. Right. And uh, he lives actually, oh, sorry, he actually lives right in the middle of the street. Yeah. He told me the biggest house on the block. Now, Ken, before I, I give you this, I do have to ask you kind of a personal question. You wouldn't happen to be a magician, would you? I am not a magician. Yeah, well, you know, you got a whole lot of trouble, sir. What? You do. There, you may have Stop that. Stop that, that. Yeah, you can fix the pothole yourself if you'd like. That is, that is insane. It's nuts, I know. Phone Jay, he'll fix it for you. You can't, I, wow. <laughs> that may be the most astounded I've been in oh, quite they, a while. 